Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah. Dear viewers, how are you today? I hope that things are going pretty, pretty good. Dear viewers, welcome to Nasi's Club. Today, in this video, I would like to teach you all about person, which is very, very important to learn English language, even grammar, even writing. So, okay, let's take a look on the lecture sheet, which is on person. Dear viewers, you know that there are three kinds of person. First person, which is I, means Ami, we means Amra, and second person, you, Tumi Tumra. Third person, uh, dear friends, you know that except first person and third person, all of the old are third person. So I've just mentioned some words of third person. Well, take a look. He, that means she, 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 it, eta, this, eta, that, ota. Yes, that indicates to singular number. That means singular object or person. And P, that indicates to plural, which is more than one or two objects or person. Well, there are so many words here that all are third person. Now, Take a look, my brother. Some people think that my this is a word and brother this is another word. So with these two words, they think that is plural, but actually that's not. You can't focus on my, you have to focus on the last word of the noun clause or of the uh, subject. Now here is the total my brother. These are the two words and and that is subject sometimes subject can be formed by more than two three or five words and you have to recognize the subject and which is placed just before the verb okay now go to the right hand here is mine and brothers so you have to focus this word and you can see here is at the end of the noun which is brother so brothers that means so many brothers my my so many brothers definitely this is plurally you have to just focus of the last word of the subject clause or noun clause well uh, take a look another example our sister so some people think our that means so many people and sister this is singular so with these two words they think this is plural but no this is not plural this is singular because our our and we have only one sister so finally you have to take a look at the end of the last word of the subject clause okay so we can't see here yes so definitely our sister single sister and here is another example our sisters our yes we have so many sisters because we get to see here as of the noun which is sister so so many sisters so that is definitely plural my brother is well i or my brothers Phone is good. Dear viewers, take a look. This is the verb. So before verb, these are the words that is subject. Okay. And take a look. My a word, there is another word, and there is another word too. So with these three words, with these three words. And with these three words, subject can be formed. And that's why this is subject. And this is verb. So now take a look here. This is also very, very important. Book, singular, a book, which is also singular, the book. Definitely singular, but definite. The means definite, which is known to us from uh, two days ago from yesterday or which is very very familiar to me I know books this is plural with all book of the world and another that is books also 
but before that we have put here the the books that means the exact and definite books that might be 4000 books or 6000 books on the table or at the library so uh, when we use that that means it is definite and that is identified and it is familiar to ours that's why we use the and uh, this is another matter that's not here so uh, a noun that can be formed in different ways okay we can put here mobiles a mobile the mobile mobiles and the mobiles well dear viewers now i'd like to take to the another part of this person i have just made two groups here okay you have to read here uh, third person singular ke ek matra ekti group e alada kore ni ja sarboda singular hoy and another is wall means baki shokol person ke arekti group e alada kore ni jar beshir bhag hoy plural dear viewers i think that you get a little bit confused about this matter you have just learned first person second person third person and we have to go to only third person and then pick up only the words that is singular so we want to go to third person and there are so many words here so we have to pick up only the word that is singular that indicates single person and single objects for example he this is he definitely it indicates one person she it indicates one person they that doesn't indicates one person it eta this eta the words that all is singular okay so we have to pick up here all the singular words from here and we have to we have to encircle these words in this group well there are so many singular words here so we have to pick up and put in this group because i have just mentioned that we have to pick up only the singular words well now uh, take a look to another group which is baki shokol baki shokol that means the rest words rest words that all are plural as we have picked up only the singular words going to the third person group and now rest of the words definitely plural and we have to put in this group the rest of the words and we have to go to first person and I, we, second person, you, and third person, all the plural numbers, these, these, uh, mm, this one also plural. So, in this way, all the plural words that we can see, we have to pick up and set here. So, uh, there is another matter that you can see I and we that comes from first person and you which comes from second person and they these those these are the words that comes from third person plural number so if you want to take a look deeply you will see that here are the words that all are plural except i and that is exception you just keep it in your mind that is exception and all the words here that all are plural Dear viewer, this lesson is very very important because if you don't understand the concept of person, you can't figure out the person. And there are three kinds of person, first person, second person and third person. You have to pick up only the third person singular words, okay, and the rest of the words that all are plural. So we have made just two groups. One is third person singular group and another is the rest of the words that is plural well in this way we can recognize the subject okay we will get so many subjects so with these techniques with this person we will manage we will identify the subject which subject goes to which person if we get it well then we can put the right verb well dear viewers if the video really really help you a lot don't forget to share to the other person so that they can learn by watching this video sitting from remote place and still if you have any query in your mind don't forget to make any comment in the comment box or you can call me as you have got my whatsapp number and other communication ways have a good day bye